Oh guys, I'm the Anime Uprise. How is it going? We'll put up, yeah, today's server so that's what we got today. Oh yay. But before we start, I do want to say, uh, hopefully you guys enjoy this little, um, uh, Malibu review thing because I've been enjoying it too. I'm hoping to get 50 subscribers. Oh yeah, it's past my birthday already. Actually, the day I'm recording this is my birthday, March 12th. Yeah. Let's get into it. Let's go. Anyways, today's Cerberus is about a boy named Chiaki, um, who encounters a dog when he's a little kid. He sees the dog. He it looks like it's hurt or something. He goes to try to help the dog. He, then he gets bit. But it turns out that that dog was, in, as in the title, a Cerberus. A three-headed dog that guards the gates of hell. And it bites off a part of his soul. The part of his soul that, that can feel joy. So the main joke that comes along in this Slice Life Supernatural sort of Slice Life manga is that he can't feel anything, he can't smell, he can't enjoy life anymore. And that's thanks to, to the Cerberus. The Cerberus has three forms. It has Kuro... I'll put the other two on the screen because I don't know. I can't, I can't at this moment in time. So I know there's Kuro. Shirogane! Okay. And the last one, I don't know, I'll probably cut this part out anyway. And yeah, so there's a Cerberus, three people, three personalities, and when Kuro gets scared, Shirogane, the attack Cerberus, one who battles most of the time. I'm not sure she's the strongest Cerberus, but you know. Then there's the, the Zun Pink one, but I don't know her name again on the screen, so whack. But, yeah. So yeah. But anyways, let's continue with my explanation. So, after that, um, her, his father, who is mysteriously on a trip tri around the world, finds the Cerberus, then sends it to his son, then where the Cerberus and Chiaki meet again. And its main form is Kuro, the dumb one. <laughs> so, yeah, it's really a final comedy sort of deal here. They just go around, and yeah, and the main joke is that, like, Kuro can leave three meters uh, far away from Chiaki, so she has to stay close. That's something that's, uh, pretty good. And I've actually enjoyed this little series, like, I'm, I'm still collecting it, like, I got volume one. Yeah. I still want to figure out who the third one is, though. Yeah, so there's little points and adventures, like, if you, the Cerberus can switch if it's like it's someone grabs a tail or um, Kuro gets really scared. That's really how it changes, and there's really fun such so like comedy sort of deal going around. Like they have the girl that loves the main character. They have the comedy relief character, which is Kuro. They have the battle character, there's like mysterious spirits come popping around. I'm looking for his soul because you know he's special because he's missing part of it, and he's a delicious. Her soul, I, I guess. That's really how they portray it. And it's kind of fun to read. I'm like, I have, I've been having fun reading this book, and the art is really good. Like, I really love this cover for Volume 2. It's very solid, and the spine trees ain't bad. But they were a bit stiff. Like, I would honestly prefer, like, this one, because it feels more, it doesn't feel as stiff because this one's like when you open it it's like you really gotta try to keep it open this one it's like from Silverland you just open it up and it feels good but it's just a, it's just a personal preference I'm being picky <laughs> so the story is basically the slice of life they're just going around and trying to find Jackie's emotions and trying to get him to feel again to feel joy in life once more so they can show that, sm that sweet sweet smile which I'll put on the screen. <laughs> oh, hopefully I actually do all these instead of cutting them out. But, yeah, I, I, I like today's 
Cerberus, I give it like, for a slice of life, like, I'm gonna give it a 7. But, because yeah, I'm giving it a 7 because I gave this one like a 6 from a Neverland. Because I really feel more inclined to reading today's Cerberus than I am to Promise Neverland. I don't know what's the draw for this one. It's just like, it just feels so relaxing to read. It has some of this comedic moments that I see big me burst out laughing. It's actually kind of, uh, I don't know why, but hey, I really recommend you read today's Cerberus, man. Like, this is a good story. Chiaki is the little boy that if you guys can actually see the book, but yeah, the little boy right there. So, yeah, yeah, yeah. But as this far, my opinion on this book is pretty great. I do love the series. It's I'm hoping to buy more. But that's really all I got for you in this one. I've already reviewed it. I like it. It's a great series. Like it's, So far, it's pretty good. Like from the first two volumes I read. I know there's more volumes of it, but like from the first two I've read, I'm pretty happy with But yeah, that's really all I got for you today. If you want to read today's servers, you can pick up the books or you like read it online. It doesn't matter to me. It's a good series, so I really recommend you read it. But yeah, and just trying to spread awareness for manga series out there. If you get really bored one day and say, I got nothing else to do, let's uh, read some manga. Just, I'll go check out today's servers, you won't regret it. Anyways guys, if you enjoyed this little anime review type thing, if you want more stuff, like I'll be gladly to take recommendations, honestly. Like I might talk about more things about myself, I might just talk about more anime, just talk about specific things, I don't know, something that pops into my mind. Like I'm gonna have some more freedom with the channel, I'm just gonna... Whatever video topic I really want to come up with that really concerns Japan, anime, and topic related stuff, you know? Like gaming and all that stuff, I might put that in? Who knows? <laughs> With that said, please leave a like, subscribe to the channel for more, almost at 50 subscribers. I'm trying to grow the channel, I'm trying to do something that can make a boom. Like I'm even going to Japan in the summer so I can just maybe go vlog and just learn more about the country, learn more of the language. Which is mainly the reason I'm going to learn more of the language in the summer. So I'm hoping I can do some great videos over in Japan when I go there. It's like everything's already sorted out, like we we're already getting like the form signed, paying the money to go, so it's like, oh, hey, I'm gonna go for around a month in a week. Yeah, it sounds good, all right. Hopefully I can make some good vlogs. I'm just <laughs> still struggling on figuring what to do. <laughs> but I'm, I hope if you stay this far, again, what's not inclining you to subscribe? Because if you like the content, which honestly, People that are making to the end of my videos. I want to know why. Can you use some criticism, please? <laughs> Anyways, if you like, subscribe. If you enjoyed this video at all, then, like I said before, again for the third time, like, subscribe, and I'll see you guys all next time.